Hi, and welcome to the uh, Spokal Feedly integration tutorial video. I'm going to show you how Spokal and Feedly work together so that you can see both your content and content that you've curated at a glance in the same editorial calendar. So this is the Spokal calendar, and you can see here on the right-hand side are blog posts that I've written um, already on my blog, as well as any that I've scheduled to be posted in the future. And you can see here that um, here, for example, are blog posts that have been pushed out already, as well as tweets that have gone out already. And these are tweets that are going to go out in the future, and I can come in here and modify any of them how I like, as well as um, drag and drop any other new ones in here that I would like. So this has been great. This has been in Spokal for some time and allowed you to share your own content. And what we can do now with the Feedly integration is you can come in here and connect your Feedly account, which is literally two clicks. Um, that's it. We're connected now. We can go back to the calendar, go into Feedly, and then say I want to you know, I'm going to have a look. I'm going to have my, my daily routine where I go through and just catch up on everything that's going on. So let's say five ha Facebook marketing hacks for your website. This looks interesting. It might be something I want to share. So I will just come in here. I'm going to tag it with the tag Spokal. And that's literally it. Now I can come back into my calendar. Now that I've connected Feedly, there's an additional Feedly tab here. And I can now drag and drop anything that I've tagged with the Spokal tag into my calendar and you'll see that it shows up the same way as my own content, just a slightly lighter shade of blue. Um, I've got all the same functionality, I can add photos, I can modify the tweet, I can do whatever I want. So at a glance I can see what's going out, when it's going out, and I know that it's going out on the times that I've set unless I've configured it specifically in each one to not do it. And we've got one extra nice little feature which is the auto tweet whenever I tag a new story and Feedly feature which basically means you don't even have to come back into Spokal. Every time you tag a story in Feedly with the tag Spokal we'll just generate a tweet, drop it into your next available time slot and that's it. You don't even need to do anything else. Um, and then you know that you're not going to have any overlapping content. You know it's going to go out when you've set your your publishing times to be and you know everything's going to get tracked and reported on within Spokal. So that's it. That's the Spokal Feedly integration.